Welcome to Crafty Workshop Builds. Today I'm going to be upgrading the rear sway bar on my Mark 6 GTI, so stay tuned. After jacking up the car, I sprayed some penetrating oil on the nuts and bolts that I'll be removing. The sway bar is held on by two brackets and two end links. I'm going to remove the end links first and then I'll remove the brackets. Now that both end links are off, I'll now remove the brackets. For some reason the nut on the back was spinning, so I had to use a wrench to hold it while removing the bolt.
This is the new sway bar that I'll be installing. This bar feels much more solid than the stock one. And this is what the upgraded sway bar looks like when compared to the stock one. I'm going to remove and reuse these two brackets. These are the new bushings that I'll be using. I'm also going to be adding silicone inside these bushings as well. This will prevent the bar from making noise due to friction. And now I'm going to install the bar.
This hole is for the stiffer setting, and this one is for the softer setting. I'm definitely going to be doing a video on addressing the rust on the lower control arm and the subframe, so stay tuned for that. And that's going to be it for this upgrade. Let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions and if you like this video remember to hit that like button and thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one